everyone, and welcome to another episode of Police Talks. Um, it's kind of an unexpected one. I just said, you know what, I need to tell people about this. Um, I just got done watching the audition um, of Emmanuel Kelly on The X Factor. Absolutely amazing, and let me tell you, um, I haven't been moved to tears like this since um, maybe like a Michael Jackson performance or... Um, you know, seeing a, a Nina Simone or Marvin Gaye footage or something like that. Absolutely, um, totally moving and humbling, especially as a singer watching him. Um, you just have to see it to believe it. I don't want to give it away, but definitely check it out. Um, I found the post on a page called Indigo Adults. So yesterday I went thrift shopping, um, and it's always a good thing. <laughs> Um, St. Francis Thrift Store on what is that, 96 and Broadway, uh, posted in the um, description of the video so that you'll have that information. But um, yeah, I went thrift shopping and I found a book called Indigo Adults. And it had an interesting little cover and it said on the back, have you ever felt like you were different? So I definitely feel like that. I decided to look more into it. And um, I had this whole questionnaire of like different things that may indicate that you are an indigo adult. Now, indigo is the color of the third eye chakra. So what they are saying is that a lot of people who are coming to the planet and being born at this time, through this period of like um, a couple of hundred years, the change from the Piscean age to the Aquarian age, they're saying that a lot of people are coming to the planet at this time with, their, with this kind of energy um, activated. And there are certain characteristics that typify an indigo adult. For instance, um, rebelling against authority, never really feeling like you quite fit in, being extremely creative and intuitive, um, and things like that. <laughs> like, totally, yeah. Um, and there's a lot of people who I know who definitely fit that description as well. It's something worth looking into. So, um, I mean, I decided to accept as fact yesterday that um, we definitely are coming into a new age and um, like the book said it's a very interesting time to be alive and the creator makes no mistakes so you are here for a reason at this time and um you have an impact to make on the world but i definitely believe that the world is changing i can feel it you know in the air i feel like it's palpable and i feel like if we as a people don't change then um what a lot of the master teachers are saying like dr jewel pilgrim and and people like that are saying that you won't be here if you don't change. And um, I love that wording that she uses. I've learned a lot watching her videos lately. So um, definitely watch the Emmanuel Kelly audition. I'm going to post the link in the description of the video so that you can see it. Um, as a singer, it was so inspiring. And it definitely was great inspiration for me for my performance next month at Apollo. Next month, sorry, no, next week, less than seven days from now, at Apollo, Wednesday, September 21st. I'm pretty excited, but I want to go in with a peaceful kind of energy, not like, ah, you know, because I just want to be calm and do what I do. Um, I was given this gift. I embrace it. I accept it. Just want to use it to the best of my ability. And really, I'm doing this for my friends and family who have come out to support me, who have always supported me. Um, I thank you guys. I love you guys. So, um, yeah. So, Emmanuel Kelly, Indigo Adult, and the Apollo Performance. Please go to apollotheater.org and check out, you know, getting your tickets. It starts at 6.30. Well, that's when the doors open. I believe the event starts at 7.30. So, doors open at 6.30. Get there early. You know, you want to get a good seat, sit with people who you know, your friends, whatever, and um, come cheer me on. I really appreciate your support. Even if you can't be there, I appreciate your support from afar. So thank you so much. Um, yeah, so look into Indigo Adults. I don't know everything about it, but um, I believe that definitely I have that Aquarian spirit. My moon sign is Aquarius and my sun sign is Capricorn. So often I have this internal struggle of to, to be traditional or to go off and just be a total black hippie, you know, so whatever, I'm walking that line. <laughs> so um, thank you for watching Halise Talks, and I cannot stress this enough.
definitely check out my show. I need you there and watch this Emmanuel Kelly performance. I cannot tell you why it was so moving, but I was moved to tears and I was over here sobbing. So check it out. Love you guys and peace.